but they have definitely been able to use innuendo and false facts to try to mislead the public. But you know what? Now it's our turn where we get to tell them yeah. the truth. Yeah. 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 years, in six years, that school property tax levy statewide went down. School yeah. districts all across the state, if you would listen only to the first six months of the year, you would think it was doom and gloom, that the world was coming to an end, that teachers wouldn't have chalk in their classroom, <laughs> they would not have an opportunity to work with their kids, but you know what? That's not the facts, because the facts are on our side. All across the state, we know that districts who chose to utilize the tools are showing that they can keep class sizes down, that we can still have outstanding teachers, and we know that in 70% of the cases where someone was either laid off, it was in a district who chose not to utilize the tools because they said it was more important to stand with the union than to stand with the kids who were in the classroom. We saw during the course of the recalls tens of millions of dollars of out-of-state funds coming into Wisconsin because they think that our elections can be bought. Anybody here think that unions are going to be able to come in and steal our Wisconsin? No! no. Because all of you understand exactly what it takes for real change. We elected a governor who said, I am going to keep my promises and I am going to work night and day to make sure we have an honest budget where businesses can create private sector jobs not have more people with their hand out waiting for something from the government. We are heading in the right 